Anson Williams has left an indelible mark on American entertainment, best known for his portrayal of the lovable Warren Potsy Weber on the iconic Happy Days, Williams' career spans decades. From his humble beginnings as a budding actor in Burbank, California, to his emergence as a household name synonymous with the golden era of television, Williams has captivated audiences with his talent, versatility, and enduring charm. Join Facts First as we present 74 years old Anson Williams confesses she was the love of his life. Anson Williams was born September 25, 1949 in L.A. He had a humble beginning, raised in a Jewish family in Burbank, California. He was the son of Haskell Heimlich, a pharmacist, and Irene Heimlich. Despite being born into a family with no showbiz connections, Williams developed an interest in acting early on. He attended Burbank High School, where he participated in various drama productions, honing his skills on the stage. After graduating from high school, he pursued his passion for acting by enrolling at L.A. City College studying theater arts. It was during this time that he decided to pursue acting as a career seriously. His big break came in 1972, when he landed the role of Warren Potsy Weber. The show, Happy Days, set in the 1950s, followed the lives of a group of teenagers in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Williams's character, Potsy, was the lovable friend of the main character, Richie Cunningham, played by Ron Howard. Happy Days became a massive success and catapulted Williams to fame, making him a household name. Career Highlights Anson Williams's career spans decades and encompasses a diverse array of accomplishments. As Potsy, he charmed audiences with his affable personality and comedic timing. He was a beloved fixture in American Household during the show's 11-season run. He also ventured into directing, a move that significantly shaped his career trajectory. He honed his skills behind the camera and went on to direct numerous episodes of popular TV series, including Beverly Hills 90210, Melrose Place, and The Secret Life of the American Teenager. While Happy Days served as his springboard to fame, he continued to explore various avenues in entertainment. He appeared in other TV series like Fantasy Island and Charmed, and ventured into film, appearing in movies like The Night the Bridge Fell Down and Skyward. In addition to work in television and film, he's pursued stage performing and public speaking as well. He's leveraged his experiences and insights to connect with audiences on a deeper level, sharing anecdotes from his career and offering motivational messages to inspire others. He's also remained active in entertainment, making occasional appearances at conventions and events related to Happy Days, where he engages with fans and reminisces about his time on the show. Up and Down Love Life Anson Williams's personal life has seen its share of significant moments, including relationships, marriages, and family milestones. In 1978, he married Laurie Mahaffey, an actress known for her roles in television and film. The couple welcomed their daughter, Hannah Lilly, into the world in 1989. But despite their initial union, they eventually divorced. Following their separation, Williams found love once again and remarried, this time to Jackie Gherkin. They enjoyed a lasting partnership for many years, with Gherkin providing support and companionship throughout Williams' career and personal endeavors. But it's been an up-and-down few years for Anson in terms of marriage. He initially filed for divorce from Jackie in 2019. But before the process could play out, he changed his mind. He asked a judge to dismiss the filing. It was likely he felt he and Jackie could work things out. But sadly, it appears that didn't happen. In 2020, he began the divorce proceedings again. He told TMZ, quote, Despite best efforts to work things out or make allowances, and as difficult as it is, sometimes you have to do what's best for everyone. But things have been looking up for the Happy Days star of late. He met Sharon Meharry, who's a real estate broker and an author, and fell in love. The two moved quickly, getting engaged and then married in May of 2023. The wedding took place at their Ojai, California home. They were set on having the ceremony there because it was the house Anson actually bought after being shown it by Sharon. At that time, he was still married to Jackie, but he and Sharon still wanted to commemorate the place they met via their nuptials. And Donnie Most, his longtime Happy Days co-star, was the best man at the ceremony. 
The two have stayed tremendously close over the years, and Most was happy to be there for his friend and co-star. It was a blessing for Mahari as well. She had recently lost her husband after being married to him for 35 years. She told People magazine that she presumed that meant she'd be a widow for the rest of her life and never find love again. But things turned for the better for her. She said of Anson, quote, He completely turned that around. It was like a gift from God that I met him. Hobbies and Passions Outside of acting, Anson has pursued various hobbies that have enriched his life. One notable interest is his love for automotive racing. He's been an avid car enthusiast for many years and has even participated in professional racing events. His passion for cars extends beyond racing as he's been involved in restoration projects and collecting classic automobiles. Additionally, Williams is known for his dedication to philanthropy. He's been actively involved in charitable endeavors, supporting causes like youth empowerment, education, and health awareness. Williams has lent his time and resources to organizations focused on providing assistance to those in need, demonstrating his commitment to making a positive impact in the community. Furthermore, he's shown a keen interest in entrepreneurship, exploring venues outside of entertainment. He's been involved in business endeavors ranging from product development to consulting, leveraging his experience and expertise. Recent Years over the past decade, Anson Williams has remained active in entertainment, although his presence in mainstream media has been less pronounced compared to his earlier years. While he may not have been as prominently featured on television screens, Williams has continued to engage with his fans through various avenues. He's made occasional appearances at conventions and events related to Happy Days, connecting with fans who fondly remember his portrayal of Potsy. A Scary Story Recently, Anson revealed one particularly scary story from when he was at the peak of his fame. He was going to a July 4th concert at the Del Mar Racetrack in California. According to Anson, thousands of people were there enjoying the show. But the stage was in the middle of the audience, and things started to get a little rowdy. The crowd pushed in so that they were completely surrounding the stage, and Anson had nowhere to escape. He said, quote, I can't get down, I can't get off, so I'm up there. I must have been up there for 15 minutes. He said that he was scared for his safety, even though there were security guards there. He said about security, quote, Finally, I get down and they kind of make a pathway. Well, the crowd overwhelmed it. I ended up face down on the field. Literally, I couldn't breathe. Fortunately, he wasn't badly hurt and didn't need to go to the hospital. But he certainly found the experience terrifying. Now it's time to hear from you. What's your favorite memory of Anson on Happy Days? Let us know in the comments section below.